hey there welcome back to my channel it's your girl mimi and i'm back with a new video so today i'm going to be making a yummy coconut rice and i'll be using a lot of vegetable in making this so literally i'll be showing you how to make coconut rice using a lot of vegetable guys if you haven't tried this recipe before please try because you're definitely going to love it so with me here uh, is um my coconut milk already i grated my coconut and extracted the milk you can choose to buy your coconut milk the thin one depending on the one you love more big, but i do love mine to be grated so i'll be using some green beans some onions carrots spring onions and uh, spring onions itself <laughs> yeah i will also be using some uh, green bell pepper some bay leaves and sweet corn some curry and ginger powder to spice it up and of course some nor seasoning too I will also be using some crayfish prawn and um, smoked fish and of course rice diced garlic and uh, pepper so guys I'm going to be deboning my fish and uh, I'll parboil my rice although some of this item here I've already done them off camera so I'm going to be deboning my fish, my bone, my rice, and we we'll got get started. So stay tuned. This is my already parboiled rice, as you can see. So up next, I'm going to proceed by adding two cubes of more seasoning into my parboiled rice. teaspoon of curry some onions Let's put all that in and um, I'm going to proceed by adding half of my squash corn pepper This is just three for four price, so this is going to go ahead and um, stir it up together. time it's been a few minutes now and uh, my rice is doing pretty well I'm going to add up my smoked fish at this point I added my thyme and bear leaves off camera I'm really sorry about that <laughs> okay let's add up the smoked fish And, uh, I'm going 
going to stir it up lightly. You need to be careful with this coconut it not rice and you know not rice easily get very faster so you don't really have to stir it up much. I'm going to cover that up to cook properly. This is cooking. I added up my vegetable oil into another pan and I'm going to proceed by frying my vegetables. So first I'll be adding up my onions. You can choose to use uh, coconut oil, it's always better to use coconut oil, but I'm using vegetable oil. Let that fry out of my carrot. And my green beans. Stir it out properly. So literally you just add up all your vegetables and season them properly. My spring onions. I'll be adding my garlic. Green bell pepper. Ginger powder, curry powder, my thyme, and I'll stir that up properly. Two cubes of more seasoning into the pot, and uh, my sweet corn too into the pot. Teaspoon of salt, and my remaining pepper. Lastly, I'll be adding my shrimps, and I'll stir that up properly to fry for some. Maybe about one minute or so. You don't really have to fry your vegetables much. I'm going to be checking my rice and. Uh, already dried up and this is the proper time for me to scoop my rice into my vegetable or scoop my vegetable into my rice any way around you can do it but you can decide to scoop your rice into your vegetables batch by batch but I'll be mixing my into the rice instead so I'm going to turn that in Take note that taking it into the vegetable pan is always the best because it will be easier for you to be able to mix them up properly. But I'm doing a short cord. <laughs> okay, I'm going to stir that up properly and that's about it. This kitchen smells so good right now. It's super good. The spice is the final result of how my vegetable coconut rice looks like, or coconut fried rice, and how you can call it. This is how it looks like, and it tastes so good. If you haven't tried this before, please try it and let me know what you think in the comment box below. 